Welcome back to the channel. It's been a long time since I've seen any of you guys and a long time since you have seen me. Uh, we have been really busy dealing with customer demands, product supply issues, and all kinds of stuff. We're gonna talk about some updates with the GR Supra. So let's first talk about the GR86. As many of you guys know, we are 86 speed as well. You can take a look at that channel here. And we have been focusing a lot of time and resources on the new platform of that car. It's a actually very interesting, fun car, and it does come in a manual. But today, let's get an update on some new products for the GR Supra. First up on our list today to talk about the Supra is the steering wheels by Rexpeed. These things are really cool. I really like the Alcantara. I like the red stitching. This is a direct replacement. This allows you to keep your factory airbag and it's available in a lot of different options and finishes. We also have these available in leather, in red and black, as well as the suede that you see here. These are super cool. I like these a lot. So I am super excited about this. This is the hood vent. This is a replacement for the factory fake duct vent on the side. A lot of people are gonna like this uh, instead of a carbon version because it just gets a more natural look. I like it because it will match the black silhouette of the side skirts and the front lip that's factory on the car. So take a look for this to come soon from us as well. Something else we manufacture that goes right along with this is a vent for the front duct inserts that are right underneath the headlights. Um, again, a complaint was all these fake ducts on the car. So this is gonna allow you to have actual airflow into the back of the car. And I think these are pretty cool. Uh, they've been selling really well. These are available on our website now. Another interesting thing that's new on the market is these AWE wind buffeting kits. As you know, the A90 Supra has since day one, if you drive with the windows down, anywhere, it could be 55 all the way up to 70, just depends, but you'll get that humming in your ears and it makes the ride not enjoyable in the Supra. So make sure you check these out. This is just a different option, a different style, a different design. These are manufactured by AWE, who we sell a lot of their exhaust. You can check out all their products on our website as well. Let's go into the car. I'm gonna show you guys a bunch of carbon bits. This stuff here is also manufactured by Rexpeed. Uh, this is some of their latest, newest products. And these are trim pieces for the interior. As you can see, I've already installed this cool shifter piece. Uh, don't be scared about installing it. It's pretty tricky, but it's a one piece design. You have to split open and pull back onto the unit. Super cool. This is the uh, cup holder. Well, the rear cubby section behind the cup holder. We got a piece that fits over the top of the leather of this, as well as a piece that fits here, and as well as a piece that comes all the way down and around the climate controls. So we're gonna start in the rear and we're gonna work our way forward with this. Uh, this is the, like I said, this is the rear cubby. And this piece, it has the tape on it. Super easy, you wanna peel your tape off. You wanna drop it in place. Uh, we're not gonna do it. We're just gonna kinda show you guys how well it fits without even pulling the tape off. That's it. So let's move on to the next piece, which is gonna be the cup holder. So this is the carbon fiber piece that I was talking about that's gonna cover up the cup holder section, cover up this leather. So we're just gonna show you how this goes on and how it fits. This is gonna be the same process as before. Give you the full look, there it is. Kind of blends in pretty well around here. All right guys, on to the next part, which I thought this was like from the beginning when we got our first car in 2019, I thought the car really needed it. Uh, this this is all factory carbon here. And this piece right here, I thought just it needed to be complete, you know, just to finish this up. So there's a good example of what that piece does and just kind of brings that carbon all into place. All right, for the last piece, uh, we have the climate control bezel surround and this just really pulls everything together. Again, this is 3M double-sided taped on, so you can guys get a good feel for what that's gonna look like. Here's a full complete center console carbon fiber upgrade that you can do for your A90, A91 Supra. I think this is super cool. I just wanted to show it to you guys. Check it out, all the links are down below, and this is just better than seeing a photo on the website, so you can see the full carbon, uh, full experience and see how it all goes together and stuff like that. Cool, let's move on over to one of the last pieces. We're gonna check out the door. Moving over to the door, there's a lot of um, parts available that are in carbon fiber. I'm gonna show you this one, which I think is a super simple, easy mod. Again, it's taped on and you don't have to remove anything. It just slides over top of everything here. So I'm gonna get this back part in real tight first and I'm gonna come in and just drop that in. And again, this is just sitting here. Uh, once you put the tape on, this will look really well. Again, there's a piece for here. There's a carbon piece for this. So now that I showed you guys some of the interior parts, uh, I want to talk to you guys. I want to take this moment to just talk to you guys about some of the things going on in the industry. I mentioned it earlier. Some products are really difficult to get. Uh, we have good stock on HKS Haas kits right now, but iBox Springs, for example, 
Those have been on back order for like six months. We just got a Paladin of 50 of those, uh, but we filled a bunch of back orders and we already have more on order. So you just gotta really, feel free to call us. Like we do answer the phone. If we don't answer the phone, we're just busy. Uh, we do reply to emails um, more frequently and you can also DM us on the Instagram account. Um, but like Power Needy, we finally got Power Needy downpipes back in stock. And Ray's, Grand Light's wheels, like they've been on forever back order. Each set we order is taking us over eight months to get straight in from Japan. So there are still a lot of delays going on in this industry and I don't see it coming to uh, a fix anytime soon or getting any better. So if you see products, you wanna check if it's in stock or find out a real ETA, just shoot us a call or give us an email and we'll be there to figure out how to help you get your products as fast as we possibly can. Thanks for watching and we'll be back soon with another video. Thank you guys.